Hey what's up guys, Totally Dubs here and today I'm going to show you how to flash over XXJVT uh, for the i9000, this is a base ROM uh, made by Facetto. Um, so as you can see it's currently flashing, it's in download mode and connected to, um, to Odin. So I'm going to show you how to set up Odin. Um, Facetto kindly provided two Odins which is brilliant because some Odins didn't work as in uh, one version wouldn't work. So as you can see, after you get the file, you'd extract it out to a folder, like so. And over here is all the folders, all the things you'll get. So as you can see, Odin start, Fisetto provided a screenshot for you guys, and Odin end. Obviously, I'm going to show you on the video what this is. So Odin 1.7, I'm going to open it up. Um, if I go on PIT, make sure you're in the right folder because over here I had 10.2 RE now that's previous version we don't want that we want JVT so um, as you can see I want to select the right folder so it was on my desktop whatever and click it as you can see repartition got automatically ticked then go to PDA choose your tar file and then you can flash as you can see my Odin is currently doing, doing that in the background now if you are on uh, Odin 1.3 however, make sure to tick repartition manually. Bang, and you can see it has not been ticked. Hopefully you can see that, as you can see, I'll zoom in, and you have to tick that. Obviously same principle applies. Um, tick it, go to PDA and do PDA as well. Now the only reason there's two versions of Odin as I said, because some people had problems. Also you can right click and run as administrator if you're on Vista or Windows 7. So that's that. So um, I'm going to go forward and, well, I'm flashing the thing, it's almost finished now. But uh, also I'm going to be flashing the JVS JVT incremental package, which provides me with some apps. And also I'm going to be flashing over the honeycomb um, theme, so to speak. Um, so this will be done via Odin, and this will be done via OTA. Uh, I'm going to show you that in a second. So. So there you go, you can hear you can hear Voodoo uh, in the background. And so this is going to be flashed via OTA, so I'm going to insert that into my internal SD card. And I'm going to flash that first. So first is Odin uh, uh, JVT RE. And then second, if you want, is the JVS JVT. And third, again, if you want, so the last two are optional, is the Honeycomb theme. Um, and I'll show you all of them on the video so everyone can see what's going on. One thing is, at the moment we're going to have um, the default stock theme on the on the phone, but when it comes down to the um, JVS JVT incremental update, it'll go back to stock um, theme. But that can be changed via the OTA app, for example. So um, yeah, there you go. Right, so I'll get back to you guys after the phone has booted up. <laughs> that was the boot animation sound and as you can see this is the boot animation so as you can see the phone has just booted up um, Odin has finished so we can close Odin and we can unplug the phone <clears throat> so we'll just go through setup right so as you can see we're on JVT uh, with dark core 4.1 JVT gingerbread JVT right so now I'm gonna add the um, JVS to JVT incremental package so I'm on USB debugging mode which I've allowed now I'm gonna just go into you can download the darky ROM tool um, from the market but we're gonna go to the market because we don't have super user so you have to make sure to download super user because I was gonna go to uh, the OTA app but I wouldn't be able to because um, I haven't got super user permission so as you can see now I'm downloading super user which now I've installed um, and there you can see it's the old market that I've got over here. Now we can open up Super User. And now we can go download the app. But in my case, I'm going to go get the app because I have it myself. Because it is the old app, or the old look of the app. There's a Super User request that you're going to need. We we'll quickly update the app. Right, so now I'm on the, on the new app. As you can see, my um, CSE is on XEU, which is great. And so now we're going to flash install file from SD card. Remember the theme. Look at the theme how it is at the moment. 
when I flash this file. Right, so following just boot up, as you can see the lock screen has changed. And we will be able to see the the apps that uh, were missing, so to speak. By going here. And there we go, are the list of apps that were missing. So for example, we had music, MTP application, Angry GPS, uh, well, forget Angry GPS, Task Manager. So for example, let's install Task Manager. Let's go out. Let's get Task Manager. And there you go. Task Manager works perfectly fine. Okay. So now I want the theme, the honeycomb, honeycomb theme, and to do this, it's very easy, um, I'm going to go into download mode, so I'm going to hold it down, and go straight into download mode, <laughs> that's like the, the SGS2 now, <laughs> um, right, and I'll connect up the phone, but the most important thing is looking at the screen. So as you can see over here, I've got that, that file, I've got the Honeycomb theme over here. I'm going to the JVTRE package, and we can open Odin 1.7. Hit up PDA, and find the Honeycomb theme, and that's it. We have one in PDA, nothing in PIT, and nothing in repartition. I'm going to connect my phone up now. It's going to pick it up. There we go. And we're going to hit start. So it's just finished flashing, so I'm going to unplug the phone. Um, and it was quite quick, well reasonably quick, just like flashing a ROM. Uh, Voodoo Voice came in, and oh my god, what's that? How did Haribo's come into the equation? I have absolutely no idea, I am not guilty. Oh, oh that was tasty. <laughs> so there you go, there's the, um, the theme. It does look very, very, very sexy. Um, very nice indeed. Um, it looks very elegant. Look at that. It's like I've never seen Tron, but I've always seen the things. Very fast indeed. And as you can see, still I'm on JVT, um, and I'm gonna go into the OTA app. Just check if my incremental thing, um, incremental thing, incremental package uh, stuck, which it should have. But let's see. There you go. It has. In other words, I can install all these, um, all these extra apps if I so wish. So there you go, guys. Uh, that is a full guide on how to get onto JVT uh, base ROM. It does look very nice. Looks very fast. I'm just going to open up the market uh, just in case to see how the market looks like. It looks like it's gone into the new market now. Um, when I flashed over the the theme and the incremental package. But the, th uh, the market can be changed very easily. If you don't like the old market, you can easily remove it by getting rid, red, uh, rid of vendor APK. And I'm just going to show you this. Um, you can also do this manually by going with um, a super manager and uh, getting rid of it. So it should be near the end actually. Vending.apk. If I get rid of that, it'll say good night to the market. And if I get rid of the market, obviously I have no market. But then if I have a market, so to speak, on my um, SD card, I can install that market as well. And that will mean that I get the old market, for example. So I'm definitely going to do that. I'm going to go for the old market because I don't really like the new market. It's kind of slow, uh, in my opinion. So there you go, guys. So I hope you enjoyed this uh, video, guys. Uh, please do rate, comment, subscribe, and yeah. Um, hope to see you guys soon. Totally dubbed out. Bye-bye.